Welcome to the task, Manage List Item Permissions. In order to accomplish this task, I'll start Internet Explorer and navigate to the SharePoint list that I'm interested in. Within the SharePoint list, I'll click the item that I want to change the permissions for, and in the Items Properties page, I'll click the Manage Permissions option on the top of the page. On the main permissions page, I'll open the Actions menu and select the Edit Permissions option. A dialog will pop up asking me if I really want to do this because essentially what I'm doing here is breaking the inheritance for permissions between this list item and its parent list and site and site collection. What this means for me is that in the future, if I make any changes at one of those other higher levels, that change in the permissions will not be propagated down to this particular list item because I will have broken the inheritance. But that's what I want for the purposes of this task, so I'll go ahead and click the OK button now. And now I can edit the items on this page. And I would like to go ahead and give the accountant group full control for this particular list item since it's for one of their conferences. So I'll ch hit the checkbox next to the accountant line, select actions, and edit user permissions. In the edit permissions page, I'll go ahead and give the accountant group full control of this list item. Now you see the changes reflected on the permissions page. The accountant group now has full control of the Bean Counter 08 list item in my upcoming trade shows custom list. This concludes the task Manage List Item Permissions.